Hey, what's going on guys? Muteki Matt here. If you prefer your beef between buns, then you're in the right place. Oh my god, yes. Because today we're talking about Henry's A5 Wagyu beef burgers in Tokyo. Oh. Henry's Burgers is known for using A5 Wagyu beef for their burgers. Now, I'm no beef expert. I am. But from my understanding, A5 Wagyu beef ranks somewhere around here. It's the best beef money can buy. So good, in fact, that I hear Wagyu cows, which are only grown in Japan, huh, they sound a little different, are fed beer and get daily massages so that when they are inevitably slaughtered, their meat comes out super moist and tender. I didn't have a cow mask. Did you say slaughtered? Because I've always wanted to try Wagyu beef, but I'm not much of a steak eater, I jumped at the opportunity to try Wagyu beef in burger form. I figured since Wagyu beef is the best beef, it should make the best burger, right? Well, I'll get to that in a second. Henry's Burgers is a small hole-in-the-wall place in Shibuya, Tokyo, and it's actually pretty far away from any popular tourist destinations. I know this because I decided to try walking from Shibuya Crossing. I figured, uh, it's in Shibuya, it can't be that far and then proceeded to walk a half hour through Tokyo, which, by the way, it started to snow in the middle of my walk. I'm glad I ended up walking though, because I got to see parts of Tokyo that are just normal neighborhoods. When I finally arrived after my journey in the snow, I was excited to see that I was the only one there. Awesome. I was even more surprised though at how cheap the burgers were. Their menu was super simple. There was four burger choices, single, double, triple, and quadruple patty. Do you want cheese or no cheese? And finally, do you want it in a combo? I ended up getting the double patty A5 Wagyu beef burger for only around 1400 yen, which is about 10 bucks. That's less than a Whopper at Burger King in California. And they don't use A5 Wagyu beef, they use Irish patties. Learned something today. Since it was freezing in Tokyo at that time, I had a really hard time picking up my burger. But when I finally took that first bite, I realized that my long, treacherous journey through the snow was well worth it. It may not seem like it by the expression I'm making on my face, but that burger was damn good. Or maybe I was just cold and hungry and any hot meal would have been good. What I will say I liked about the place is that it felt like a low quality fast food place but with really expensive meats. Doesn't sound good when I say it out loud. The best way I could describe it is it tasted like a regular burger, but with a deeper and more intense burger flavor. Wow, I suck at describing burgers. It was double the flavor. The burger was paired with two quarter pound savory flame grilled 100% A5 Wagyu beef patties topped with juicy tomato, fresh cut lettuce, creamy mayo, crunchy pickles, and a sliced white onion on a soft sesame seed bun. That is how Burger King describes their Whopper. Let's be honest, Burger King Whoppers don't taste as good as they describe. But you know what does taste like what I just described? A5 Wagyu Beef Burger from Henry's Burgers in Tokyo. You know what? You tried describing a burger. It tastes really good. What else can I say? It tastes like a hamburger. You've had a hamburger. It was a really good hamburger. Damn. Regardless, I'm glad I went to Henry's, even if it's just to say I've tried an A5 Wagyu beef hamburger. I'm giving Henry's Burgers five hot dogs out of five. Yo, homie, just put the hot dog down, bro. Uh, excuse me? That's homo me? Vanessa homo me.